Hey America, Chef John to get a gourmet here. Joker is off doing something crazy. Whoa, that's loud. So tonight's dinner is gonna be really quick. Um, what we got down here in the deck is I marinated that chicken with a little bit of uh, curry and paprika. I got some green pepper, got some um, cilantro, some garlic, some eggplant pieces, tomatoes, some onions. I really don't know what I'm doing. I got a little bit of, um, that's uh, tricolored couscous with a little bit of chicken stock in it. Um, I'm tired, I'm hungry, I want to eat now, and I drank a beer, so, ouch, and I just got burned, but besides all that, <laughs> so I skipped on some of the, um, the basics today, uh, it's just chopping up some stuff, whenever you cut a pepper, I want you to cut the pepper from the back, I want you to think of a pepper as a square, and then cut the side off the square, and cut the side off the square, and then come at the pepper from the back, cut the fins out, and then you can get some really nice cuts. Don't try to cut through the skin, it's a little tricky. So, throwing the chicken in the pan. Uh, and we're gonna let the chicken just go for a hair. I'm gonna let you watch as much as you can. <laughs> um. So this is, uh, what we're going for is, I'm going for a paprika, garlic, cilantro flavor, okay? So everything else after that is gonna be like a backup flavor. That's the main thing I'm going for here. And I ran out of paprika, so I used a little chili powder too. I would really like this to be really bright red with paprika, but um, I ran out. Um, so I gotta do what I gotta do. So, um, now that's cooking. Let me put a little bit more butter in there. And you see the colors are coming out nice. It's already starting to brown, so I'm gonna flip my chicken. Oh my gosh, look at that. I almost got every piece to flip over. That's pretty cool, huh? Um Happy Halloween everybody. And um all you East Coasters, I know you're going through some stuff. I got a lot of family out there. Little brothers in in Brooklyn. My moms and dads from Florida to uh, Washington, D.C. And um, I hope you all are just weathering through it. I love hurricanes when I was there, but I understand it. It's, it's no joke. I mean, I, 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 got, a, I got a message from, uh, on Facebook from a friend that uh, some, uh, a big old limb fell on her ex Alexis, but everybody's okay. Hey, look, man, serious things are about to start happening in this country with the weather during this year. I made this prediction last year. They call me Thor for a reason, okay? It's not because of that, all right? It's because of that and because of that. So we added the green peppers. I'm going to add my other hard um, stuff. I'm saving my tomatoes. Uh, I put my garlic in. I'm saving my tomatoes. And my cilantro for the end here. Um, so look, man, we're going to be going through some stuff, all right? Like we went through some stuff with this re uh, recession, which personally, I think is a wonderful thing. Not the recession, okay? Not the recession. But the fallout of the recession caused families to start living together. Now, the greatest strength this country has ever known was during the time period of the 30s and the 40s and the 50s. Now, why the 30s were so powerful? This is what we're looking at. That looks pretty, huh? Why the 30s were so powerful 
was that, yeah, we had a recession. There goes the cilantro. I just want to toss that for a second. Here come the tomato. And I'm feeling like this is really dry. So we're going to wet it up somehow. And I got some... I got a lemon. We're going to put a little lemon in there. A little lemon. I ain't got much left. Here, come over here. So, um... The consequences of this storm is that 200 million or 100 million people or 80 million people or however many are being affected are sharing the same experience. It's not a good experience to some, all right? It's going to be people hurt. There's going to be people be without power. And there's going to be a lot of people coming together, okay? That's what I'm talking about. A lot of people coming together. So, yeah, I'm all the way over here in Oregon. And I got loves for you, America. And um, I want you to look at not necessarily the reality, the 140 characters that's going, <laughs> that's going on, man. I want you to look at the book. I want you to look at the social gradient. Because life is social gradient, man. Life isn't about... Life's not about the day-to-day -day sometimes. Sometimes it's about the real serious stuff. When we really need to come together as a country. And maybe this weather is going to help us all do that a little bit. Maybe we're going to forget about the, the, the twists and turns that this election and this time period and the recession and all that is doing in our lives. And look at the reality, all right? This storm is serious and people are getting hurt. And then people are coming together. In crisis, in crisis, we rock, America. We rock. And I say that from my own experience. I say that with all my thanks to all the people who have helped me and the hundreds of seizures and spasms that I've had who stopped their cars, who stopped their busy days and came over to make sure I was okay. And you only find that in a society where the, the root of the society is a good people. All right? So beyond all the blah, 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 it's not my fault. No, 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 this ain't real. You're the problem. Look what you did. Rise above it, brothers, sisters, America. <laughs> and eat wonderful. So, yeah, this is from a chicken that I um, that I took apart myself. I broke a chicken down. Which I'm going to teach you how to do soon enough. All right? Chef John, the Ghetto Gourmet. I want you to eat better in your home. And I hope, I hope what I said meant something to you, okay? We rise in crisis. We rise when things are hard. We love and give heart when it's needed most. Chef John, Ghetto Gourmet. Once you eat better in your home, America. Sorry, pointing. Ow, my eye! <laughs> during this time, during this Halloween season, during this huge storm, Let's just think about what's important, man. The lady who's got her car smashed, this is what she said. She said, everybody's safe. Everybody's okay. And we're sleeping in the living room because we don't trust the big trees outside. So, peace. Love you, America. Be better.